Welcome to our Battlefield 1 weapon guides. In today's episode we take a look at the Mondragon semi-automatic rifle. We'll start by taking a look at the damage output. This works pretty straightforward for the semi-automatic rifles. Its maximum damage is 40 damage per shot, but after its maximum damage range it deals 35 damage per bullet. This means you will kill an enemy within 3 shots. But you can kill an enemy within 2 shots if one of them is a headshot. The headshot multiplies 1.7, the upper body multiplies 1.0, and the lower body and limbs have a multiplier of 0.90. The damage is best in class, similar to the Selbstlade M1916. But the Mondragon has a better rate of fire at 257 rounds per minute, meaning that its damage per second or DPS is better though the rate of fire is still at the lower end of its class. It has a missile velocity of 800 meters per second, which is the highest in class, similar to the self -plotter. The weapon deals its maximum damage of 40 until 26.5 meters, from where it starts to descend, until the minimum damage at the range of 51.5 meters. This also is similar to that of the self slider M1916. Now let's take a look at the handling, which is actually pretty important for the semi-automatic rifles. The vertical recoil is 0.6, the horizontal recoil is for both left and right 0.192, the recoil decrease is 4 and the first shot multiplier is 1, as always. The handling is the best in its class. The aim now side spread is 0.18 when you're standing still, but this goes up to 1.02 when you're moving. The hip fire spread is 2.5 when you're standing still and 4 when you're moving. There is no spread increase per bullet. When comparing it to the other semi automatic rifles, it is the most accurate when standing still. It has a magazine capacity of 10 rounds, which isn't that good, but certainly usable. The reload is fairly slow since it's a shell by shell reload. It takes 567 milliseconds per shell. And the total reload takes 3766 milliseconds. It has three variants similar to most weapons. The Mondragon Storm, which has a recoil reduction but uses the iron sights. The second variant is the Mondragon Optical, which has better accuracy while stationary removing and has an optic. And the third variant is the Mondragon Sniper, which has better accuracy when stationary, a bipod, long range scope. When running the medic class, this is my favorite weapon due to the high DPS and the best in class handling characteristics. It's generally best when used conservatively, which also goes well with the medic playstyle. My favorite variant is the Mondragon Sniper. We hope you now have an overview of the Mondragon. Thank you for watching. The source that we have used are mentioned in the description. If you enjoyed the guide, consider leaving a rating, we would appreciate it very much, because it helps us out a lot. And if you have any questions, uh, comments or constructive feedback, leave those in the comment section down below.